Sorry for me looking like a mess. Uh, hi guys, my name is Paradox. Not really, but that's my YouTube name. Uh, my name is Paradox. This is my face. Me. This is my channel. Uh, if you guys have stumbled across this video, thanks for stumbling across this video. Uh, today, is, this video is just like a sort of an intro to my channel. Uh, I'm a gaming channel. Let me fix this. I'm a gaming channel and uh, I have some experience with YouTube. It's just, I didn't really know what I was doing. I didn't really know how to edit or anything like that, so my videos didn't look clean, crisp, and stuff like that. But I'm pretty, I'm okay. I still really don't know how to edit, but I'm trying to come at this more serious than my last channel because I started my last channel when I was like 11. I'm 13 now. And when I was 11, I really didn't know what I was doing with the channel, and so I was just having fun putting videos on the internet. But, uh, I decided to take it more serious, so I'm currently not on that channel anymore. Uh, I'm not gonna delete that channel, because I'm just gonna keep it as a comparison of what my channel was and what it is now. But, uh, so basically today I'm just gonna go through a run-through of my stuff, and what I use to make my videos. So right now, you're on a camera, not a camera, a phone. Uh, it's the Droid Motorola Turbo 2. It has a 21 megapixel front facing camera, 16 megapixel, megapixel rear facing camera, and I'm trying, I'm gonna get like a lavalier uh, mic right here so the mic quality can be a bit better because I know it's, my dad tells me it's okay, but Compared to other mics for on, being on a phone, yeah, it's good. But compared to other mics that people on YouTube are using, it's not the best. So I'm wanting to upgrade to a new uh, lavalier mic. So that's going to be another thing that I should add in the future. And then, so basically we're just going to start off with what I use to monitor my streams. I either use my phone, this laptop. Uh, I'm looking at my phone screen back there so I can see what I'm showing. Looking at... This is the Lenovo N22. Uh, it's not that bad of a laptop, it's just, it gets the job done. It's got a pretty long battery life. Not that bad of a typing experience. It's got a movable camera, as you guys can see, like that. I never record on this, just to let you know. That's... That's weird. Hope my hope my sister doesn't open up my door. Okay, so that's basically what I used to. I probably will use it to edit and watch or monitor my streams whenever I do stream. Uh, yes, I do stream. I will see if I can leave the link to my streaming channel in the description. I probably won't because I don't have it set up yet. But uh, this is usually what I have my uh, Twitch pop out. You guys can see my phone right here. That's my phone. That's me. That's what I, uh, this is what I use for, like, the Twitch chat pop-out. I have it on this, so I can just put it up like that, and I can read the chat as it scrolls down. Works pretty neat. It's a Kindle Fire. It's okay. Here's my mouse. I'm gonna upgrade to a better mouse soon. Uh, this is the Logitech M325. Using Kale mouse switches. Uh, it says tw 16 or 26 step scroll. It's just a durable mouse. It goes through a bunch of beatings at school. Uh, then we have my controller. I have some control freaks for it, but I forgot to grab them. They're uh, the Atomics. Control freak Atomics. I usually put them on these, on this when I'm playing like Call of Duty or something like that. I use the normal thumbsticks for Fortnite and if I'm not using the controller in Fortnite I'm using this. I need to fix the space bar, I just realized that. You guys can hear this keyboard is a myth keyboard. It's got, it's really dusty, I need to clean it, but, uh, 
And these are just some cum custom key switches, I mean keycaps I did. They're not the best looking. Not the best looking. They just got their own little splatter on them. Uh, one, this one's blue, green, yellow. That one's red. And they, they, they just give a better grip than these normal ones. Because if like my fingers were oily, they wouldn't slip on these as much as they would slip on here. And then these are matte, so it doesn't give that oily shine if they do get oily. But, uh, overall the typing experience on this, you can, uh, raise the feet up with these little rubber pads right here. They can fold down too. Got some design, designs on the back. Usually I use it down for gaming, but for typing, I'll have it up. Uh, this is this is a TKO eighty one eight uh, eighty seven or eighty one key keyboard, but if I can. It is RGB too, so that's a plus for that. It's not like customizable RGB or anything, but it does have RGB, so I'm kind of happy with that. I can get this tripod to stand straight. Oh, snap. <laughs> oh, it just fell off. It just fell off the stand it's on right now. Oh my god. Give me a second, guys. Alright, I'm back. I just had to, it just fell off, like it tipped back and just fell off. Well, that was hilarious. But, uh, that's the keyboard I use. Um, I forgot to tell what switch it is. This keyboard is using Cherry Mix Blue Knockoffs, basically. They're called Otimo Blues. Uh, these, this is the dust cover, not the dust cover, the stabilizer edition, the dust cover. See how these look like parentheses around the plus sign? The other one looks like brackets. This thing looks like this thing around it. And so, it's that one's for dust covering, and then this one is for stability. Almost dropped my keyboard. My keyboard is a really cheap keyboard. I found it on Amazon for $36, and then the white one is $35. I should have got the white one. I like the white one more, but uh, yeah. And then we have my... Uh, this is what I have all my audio come through because it's it's about equal to the sound bar on my TV, but the sound bar on my TV doesn't have as much bass as this thing has. And this is a bit clearer, but not really noticeable to the ear. Uh, let me put my keycap back onto my keyboard. And then we get to my headset. This headset is a really, really big headset. Uh, this is the Logitech G633, wired, not wireless. I wanted the wireless, but I put G633 down instead of G933 for Christmas. They're the same, one's wireless, one's wired. Uh, this one is RGB, but it's not plugged in right now. Uh, comes with a bunch of uh, controls for PC. I don't, well, I don't play on PC, I play on PS4. Uh, you can switch between PC and 3.5 millimeter. It comes with a 3.5 millimeter cable with inline controls. This is using Logitech Sport Mesh. I think that's what they call it. I don't know what type of mesh they're using, but uh, and then they have mesh up here. I'm hoping to upgrade to either the HyperX Cloud. HyperX Cloud 2s or the Astro A40s with the Mixamp Pro. I want to get those for the mic uh, on those. The mic on that one is really good. And the mic on this one is ex very good too. This is a very good mic. Uh, it's a dual, dual facing mic. It picks up, uh, well, I should say it's bi directional. If you want it to, it'll pick up, pick up from out here and out here. Uh, you have to have the set the thing. I think it's bi-directional. I don't know. But I know it picks up from right here. I don't know if you can turn it off. If 
you do, if you could, it probably would be in the Logitech software, G software, or G for gaming. This is part of the Logitech G series, G633. And overall, it's just, it's a big headset. It's got very big ear cups that, cause it's 7.1 surround sound too. Um, it's not, it's not a stereo headset, you can't change it to stereo. But, uh, that's the headset I use, really. Uh, it's, it's, it's a nice headset, I like it. Uh, it's, this is the cable I have for it. The breaded cable decided it was gonna chip. Uh, I mean, the little prongs, here, let me show you. This cable, out. this cable is really sturdy in it. Uh, so the little prongs, I don't know if you guys can see. Those little lines right there have two prongs in them. And those prongs face, I swear to God, these bitty bugs, they just keep flying into my window and getting under my windscreen because I'm stupid and tried to go onto my roof through it and now it's bent and anything can get through it. But um, those little prongs decided to push in so it won't touch the connectors in here. So there's that. Uh oh, okay, I'm plugging it in backwards. Also, you can take the covers off on these. So if you want to see the light, this is where the light is. Because it shines through the G logo, which is double shot. I forgot to mention, my keyboard is double shot injection too. And uh, that's pretty much going to sum it up. So I from over there, there is my TV. My... Hello. Hi. Hi. I don't know. Did someone? I don't know. I thought I heard you run downstairs. No. Okay. 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 Bye. Bye. That's my sister. But uh, that's the TV that I game on. It's an Insignia TV. And then there's another controller. Another PS4 controller. My PS4 is sitting. Oh my god. I always thought this was going to work, but it wasn't. My PS4 is sitting right here. There's that. It needs to be cleaned. I'm about to clean everything before I start streaming. Here's some. Here's some, uh. Okay, phone start to lag. Here is the. Wow, that is really lagging my phone. Here's the audio cable for it. And then there's the USB cable for my headset. Put that back because my phone decided it was gonna lag, so give me a second, guys. Okay, there we go. I stopped the light. It was lagging on my end. And then we have... Oh, there's one of my control freaks. Where's the other one? Lost? Okay. That's my Fitbit. And here is my glasses case. PlayStation 2 card. The one I played on my PlayStation 2, which is right over there. Camera. I don't use because... I can't find the charger for it. I don't know where it went. And there's that. And then we have a USB hub that I added to my PS4 so I can have more USBs. It works out. I didn't really have, an, I don't, didn't know where my hot glue gun went, so I had to duct tape it to here. But when I find it, it'll be hot glued, so it looks a whole lot cleaner than this. Uh, but that pretty much. See, this is the sound bar that I was talking about. But that, uh, that pretty much sim sums it up and. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, stay tuned, stay awesome, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace. These darn ladybugs, look at all of them. Sorry I'm not in the video, but look, they're just everywhere. Get off.